Hello everyone, we're coming to you from Haifa, where we've just held a ceremony to mark International Holocaust Remembrance Day. This is a day set aside by the United Nations, the European Union, that all over the world people would remember the Holocaust, honor those who perished, and uh, celebrate those who were heroes and who have survived it. We had quite a few uh, Holocaust survivors here this evening. Every January 27th, we should be thinking about the Holocaust, remembering it, learning more about it, telling others. And uh, we really had a good evening tonight with the, the uh, Foreign Minister of Israel, Eli Cohen. We had three other members of Knesset here. And of course, our friend Shimon Sabag, who run, helps us, uh, partners with us in the Home for Holocaust Survivors in Haifa. We had a lot of these dear survivors with us this evening, and it was so great to have them all. How are you, my dear? Many Many of them uh, we helped rescue out of the Ukraine this year and put some of them in the, uh, in the home. They, they were fleeing the war. We got them out from some of these bombed out cities and they're now living up here in the Haifa home. And uh, we just want to encourage you Friday, January 27th, today, take a moment to pray for Israel, pray for the Jewish people, remember the Holocaust, maybe watch a video, a documentary or something, a movie about the Holocaust to educate yourself better and to tell others and make it a habit every year. Don't let this day go by without honoring those who perished in the Holocaust. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes. You are the preparer.